so what we're looking at here is all right so if you check out placement i didn't want to pull from that side over there because there's a vehicle over there so since this is two naked spots we pull from this side so basically i'm trying a new attachment to the mount y'all for the camera so bear with me because i'm learning all right so now we're going to roll the bed down and what we're going to do is when we get the bed down i want to get my bed pretty much right there those two front tires okay what i have learned is, is the less pulling you do of your cable right like the less you stretch your cable out the less you got to worry about re-spooling it and stuff and i mean for me if you can get it on the on the truck or get your bed real close to it i feel that that's wise all right So yeah, this is a completely new attachment for the um, camera. So we're gonna see what y'all think about it. Just comment down below and let me know what y'all think about the uh, angle, the sturdiness, if it's if it's wiggling around, if it's set out too far in front of my chest. I'm gonna need to hear from you guys about all of this. All right, I don't like going on these, y'all, for these, okay? So I'm gonna go behind the front tires. I always feel better um, if I'm pulling from the front to go behind the front tires and if I'm pulling from the back to go behind the, the back tires. Uh, I know that we all have our own different preferences and stuff, um, but for me, I do not want to um, have to reattach none of my chains. So. I like to try to I like to try to get what I want on my first grab to where I don't have to re-grab, you know what I mean? All right, so you see how the cable's kind of touching that tire? I want to show y'all something. All right, neutral. Get my wheel turned. So what I'm doing is once I get this thing right, I got those wheels turned sharp. Once that truck gets about that much up, I'm gonna raise my bed, okay? I'm gonna raise this bed and I'm gonna pivot and I'm gonna straighten this thing out. Okay, and I kind of want to show it to y'all. So we're gonna we're gonna do this on camera. Do you see the do you see the casualty the car back there? Watch. Watch as I pull out. She straightens up. See how she's straight? So now I can go and lay my bed down. Right? Suck it all the way up on the bed now. You know what though? Grab this one to finish with. All right, y'all. So we're gonna lay the bed back down on the ground, okay? We'll straighten this wheel some. Got my remote. I like to use it so I can stand back and it allows 
better shots for people. You know, you can see the whole shot. She's in park. All right, and now I had had a guy tell me recently, um, Mr. Mike, uh, I get a lot of advice from him. He said to, to chalk the tires um, and it can keep, something about keeping from rolling on, rolling on the um, parking pin. I can, to be honest, y'all, it's hard to remember every little comment and I do try and I do want to try to get every um all these you know new ideas and try to you know utilize them so with that the um there's another one that he said too about a tow pin um and a snatch block he said that the snatch block that I have isn't necessarily um the right one for my what I do he's saying something about the snatch block I need to, needs to have a hook on it and I know which ones he's talking about they're bigger I believe if, I, if, if I'm understanding what he's saying. So with that, we will um, be able to, uh, if I get that snatch block, I'll be able to um, do the trick that he's talking about with the um, toe pins, or to keep from using a toe pin. Make sure I keep this thing out of the trees. But yeah, um, so I'm about to be doing a few different new things. I'm gonna, can y'all comment down below and let me know what y'all would think about some of the um, videos being a little bit of riding time in the truck and driving and um, getting the approach to the vehicles and stuff as opposed to me getting all that done before the video. Um, my idea was is to try to make the videos as action packed as possible, short, and you can see exactly, you know, the action. But apparently that's not the best way to set it up for YouTube. They're basically kind of suggesting that I start getting longer videos and in those longer videos also um, trying to keep the attention of the audience for long. They want y'all to watch the videos, the longer videos for longer. So um, I'm gonna be trying to go through my playlist and stuff and make it to where y'all can have easier access to the long videos. Let's closed. Throw straps all the way around. You guys, if y'all haven't already, smash that like button. Comment down below on um, any videos y'all might want to see. I appreciate y'all watching. Subscribe if you already haven't.